A bipartisan task force toured the Pennsylvania field where a gunman tried to assassinate former President Donald Trump. The group of House lawmakers surveyed the grounds in Butler County. That's where Trump held a rally on July 13th. They also made it onto the rooftop where the 20-year-old gunman laid in wait and opened fire. He hit Trump, critically injured two rally goers and killed another man. But lawmakers, they say that it was important to be in a physical space where a massive security failure happened. The big thing for us being here today was to actually be on the ground, get familiar with the ground, be comfortable with the questions we were going to ask because of the way it was laid out. I definitely took note today that there were a lot of lines of sight that appear to have been unsecured that day that didn't have on, uh, eyes on or, or that weren't secured. And certainly uh, at this point, a lot more questions than answers. The task force has subpoena power as it tries to identify security failures. The panel has until December 13th to submit its findings, including any recommendations to change laws and policies.